What's up? I'm OBG for tastingskills.com. Welcome back to another video. Today I'm talking about Kirkland Canadian Whiskey. Now this came out about three months ago on the market. You can get it at pretty much every Costco store out there. So what is actually in the bottle? Well, this Canadian whiskey is made by Diageo, which basically is the producer of Crown Royal. Now, it's the actual same Canadian whiskey that is in here. It's aged for a minimum of six years. Now, Canadian whiskey, you're allowed blending up to 10% in sherry. So we don't get the actual perfect blend of what amount of sherry they're putting in there, but when you taste it, you can tell that there's actually some sherry in there. All right, so let's take a look at the tasting notes, but before that, do you wanna taste like a pro? Head over to tastingskills.com, put your name and email into the magical yellow box, and I will send you my free 17-page guide to the fundamentals of tasting. And when you're there, you can also check out our awesome sober hat, t-shirts, I also have hoodies, and if you put it in your cart and you put the promo code IMOBG, shipping will be free. All right, so let's jump into these tasting notes. On the color, bronze amber with reddish hints, due to, of course, the sherry in here. On the nose, sherry, oak, caramel, honey, orange zest, complex and well-balanced between the layers of alcohol that are in here. The sherry notes come at you in layers of complexity. This has a beautiful sweet nose. On the mouthfeel, high viscosity and thick on the mouthfeel. The mix of oak and sherry notes are complex as it delivers beautiful wood tannins that are spicy and it push a lovely sweet acidity that gives you a nice length. This is high-end quality when it comes to the finish, but it feels like there's a little bit too much glycerol on here. So a few things. First of all, this retails for $30 for a 1.75. Now, if you would get the same thing as Crown Royal, you'd be looking at $43. So you'll save at least $13. This was really good. My only complaint was that it was a little high on the glycerol side. Now, if you don't know what glycerol is, it's an actual thing that you can add within whiskey or vodkas, and it's pretty much in everything, and it gives it this sweet little layer, a little bit more viscosity. I think that they just went a little too big on the viscosity side of this, but I know that this is meant to be drank as a cocktail. I know my father-in-law drinks this regularly. He is a big Crown Royal guy and he mixes it with 7-Up. Now, can he tell the difference between this and Crown Royal if he'd be drinking it with 7-Up? Probably not. This is a great purchase. I mean, you're getting six-year-old Canadian whiskey here for under $30 in a full handle. Yes, this is a buy. I mean, it's a no-brainer. And my recommendation is that you taste side by side this and Crown Royal and you make your own decision because in the end, what you think is what's important. All right, now that's gonna do it for me. I'm OBG for tastingskills.com. Please remember to smash that like button and now go down there, click the bell right after you subscribe. Otherwise, my friend, please remember, stay sober. Peace.